Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Morgan. I am a homeschooling mom of two and I create homemaking, homeschooling, and homesteading content over on this channel. If you find this video interesting or helpful at all, please consider hitting that red subscribe button and maybe even turning on the bell notifications. It helps me out a ton and it doesn't cost you a thing. Today I am going to be doing a little review and flip through of the Sm Evan Moore Smart Start Beginning Coding Grade 1 from Timberdoodle Homeschool Company. So if you're interested in learning more about this and seeing a full flip through, then stay tuned. Okay, so Timberdoodle was kind enough to send me this um, to review. So that's what I'm going to do. These are all my opinions. Um, Timberdoodle is very transparent with their affiliate team um, reviews and things like that. Um, they if they, they t straight up tell us if you don't like it, let us know. Um, but I actually really love this. So actually, I don't think I've had anything that I haven't like loved. There's been stuff that hasn't worked for us, but um, I haven't had a bad product yet. So. Anyway, um, this is by Evan Moore, but it is carried by Timber Doodle. It is $9.99 on their website, so great price for what you're going to get here. It is the Evan Moore Smart Start Beginning Coding Grade 1. So it says it has critical thinking, computational thinking, and basic skills for coding. Um, it is correlated to current standards, like Common Core standards. So this has audio... I haven't used that part yet, but it has audio and like read aloud stories. So I'm kind of interested how that works, but I love that they include that in such a reasonably priced book. I think that's a really great add on because a lot of times you'll get like a QR code for some like extra content after you spend like $600 on a curriculum. So like it's really, which whatever, but like it's really cool that um, something as inexpensive as something like this has those, this kind of QR code with that information so that's pretty cool um i am going to do a full flip through of this uh so you can actually see better but right now i'm just going to kind of talk about it and flip it so i can see it um, but i will do a full full um flip through and kind of tell you what evan moore and timber doodle say about this book but this is just my part of what i see when i first open this book so first things first i absolutely love that it is in full color it is absolutely beautiful beautiful book they have all of the which sometimes people don't do and i don't understand why they don't do this in books but when you have to cut something out they leave a blank page so you can cut it out some books don't do that and i'm just like i mean i guess they want you to photocopy it but like what the heck are you doing um but i mean that's fine it's just I don't know, it's harder to do. So the first thing they tell you is, da, 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 it gives you kind of a vocabulary lesson and it almost teaches the parent, like why the heck would my kid need to learn coding um, in first grade? My kid is kind of in a K first situation right now. He's kind of between, we don't really do grade levels in our homeschool, um, but this is a first grade book. So this is going to teach the basics of coding in the most fun and tangible way for a five, six, seven year old to do coding. So it is set up in six different like lesson sections, algorithms, decomposition, patterns, debugging, and lo loops and conditionals. Um, truly, I am not even sure what like debugging and conditionals i'm not even sure what that is because i never learned any sort of coding like this was not something that we learned but we weren't like super computery back then um i mean i'm not that old but like we didn't learn coding and we certainly didn't learn coding in first grade so it's it's just really fun it's an, a really fun hands-on book um and there's like movement activities and then after those See, after conditionals there's a review and there's a bunch of different I don't want to say tests but there's like activities they can do and then there's a bunch of projects that you can cut out there's origami which is coding um, puzzles and mazes and there's just so much to do um, for them what are coding projects let's see what else is back here there's always a really nice um, like 
certificate. Almost all these Evan Moore books have like a really pretty certificate, which my son absolutely loves these. He prints these, or like we, he, we pull these out and put them in his little book and he absolutely loves them. So we love this book so far. Um, it has a little, um, a little section about all, what all the different words are, answer key, which sometimes you need these, sometimes they're a little tricky. Uh, so, and then there's a big old page of stickers in the back. So I am going to do a full flip through now and just kind of do a voiceover and read what Evan Moore and Timber Doodle say about this book. But so far, this looks like a great, great thing to add into our homeschool. Um, I'm so excited to add this to like his, his um, math curriculum. Um, and I think it's gonna be a really fun thing for him because he's super analytical um, and super, technical and this is something that my son is absolutely going to tear up like he's going to love this and he's not going to want to stop um doing the different projects and stuff so i'm so happy that timber doodle sent us this um so let's show i'm going to show you the inside of the book so this book is 9.99 on the timber doodle website and it is included in the grade one curriculum kit and right from their website, it says, build a strong computer science foundation screen-free with beginning coding first grade. Colorful and fun hands-on activities help children make real world connections to coding. Beginning coding connects coding concepts to life with games and puzzles that introduce basic coding rules. Based on the K-12 computer science framework, beginning coding is organized into themed units of algorithms, decomposition, sequencing, pattern, debugging, loops, and conditionals. If these are not familiar, familiar terms to you now, they will be when your child finishes this course. The computer science concepts and skills taught through beginning coding will help your students become critical thinkers by learning how to break down complex problems into smaller ones. They will also connect similar issues and realize that the order in which things happen is essential. Help your early learner become a critical thinker with the computer science concepts and skills taught through beginning coding. So that was the full look through of the Evan Moore beginning coding grade one from Timber Doodle. I will link it in the description box and I will link the curriculum kit it comes in, the first grade curriculum kit. Um, I will link that as well. and. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to check this out, those links will be there for you. Thank you, Timber Doodle, for sending us this book. We love it, and we absolutely love Timber Doodle Homeschool Company. Like, it's the best. Um, so, thank you for watching. Remember to hit that subscribe button if you haven't, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. to be someone who